you guys hear me okay? Yeah. yeah. Hello, everyone. I uh, appreciate the hospitality. We'll talk a little bit about, um, I guess, my path. Uh, my path has been um, one that I picked up since I uh, was about 12 years old. I started with um, you know, just purely education, I come from an educational background. And I was never pressured into any, any religion at all. Uh, but the one thing that my parents taught me, you know, was search for knowledge. Okay? So the three books, Bible, Torah, Quran. Um, although my family is a Christian background, so of course we lean towards that Bible, right? which was a good thing. Um, I read that for many years. Um, it caused a lot of confusion, asked a lot of questions. Um, those questions still today have not been answered. But when I got to the third book, which was the Quran, the answers were clear. And so, um, continuing my education, graduating, uh, getting married, children, the Quran has always resonated. So the only thing left was for me is to um, to put it into action. So I'm here with you guys today to make the commitment. So, thank you. I bear witness. I bear witness that there is no one. That there is no one worthy of worship. Worthy of worship or obedience. Or obedience except Allah. Except Allah. And that Muhammad. And that Muhammad is his slave. Is his slave and messenger. And messenger. And I bear witness. And I bear witness that Jesus. That Jesus, the son of Mary, the son of Mary, is the messenger of Allah. Is the messenger of Allah and his slave. And his slave. Allah. Congratulations to Islam. At this point, by the blessing of Allah, all of your previous sins are cleansed. So we, all of us in this hall, are jealous of you because you stand on the higher rank of us. And we ask, uh, since you are in this pure state now, that you make uh, prayer, sincere prayer for all of us. And our path to being committed to this guidance is easy for all of us. And we sincerely offer our hospitality and our brotherhood to you, to us, to the Muslims, this phrase of La ilaha illallah that you just iterated, this phrase of there no one being worthy of worship or obedience except Allah, to us this bond is thicker than blood. To us this bond transcends knowledge, trans transcends uh, race, transcends uh, nationality, transcends age and gender. It is, it is the strongest bond that can possibly be. And you are inshallah now a part of this fraternity and this brotherhood uh, for life. We pray that your journey is uh, made easy, I would suggest I'm not a local here, so I would suggest that brothers that are local to this community, don't overwhelm him. <laughs> don't start trying to teach him all of Islam over a five minute conversation. Do not give him any suggestions. One, at the most two people are the direct point of contact. A lot of people are gonna to try to tell you a lot of things. So just take it easy, it's okay, don't get overwhelmed. He doesn't need to read 30 books at once. He doesn't need to learn how to pray over, you know, before the weekend is over. It's okay, we can take it nice and easy, inshallah ta'ala. Those of the brothers here that are involved with da'wah work, please uh, take an initiative to meet with him. All of us, of course, should congratulate him. But take an initiative to meet with our brother, inshallah ta'ala, and establish regular contact with him. So we may, you know, uh, uh, have him slowly and maturely grow into obedience to Allah and learning uh, the knowledge of this deen and practicing it. Jazakumullah khairan. We, again, we can all congratulate you and welcome you into the fraternity of Islam. Takbir!